run away snacks never come back. Oh. <coughs> I don't get it. Why are the little ones attacking us? They love me. They're like a mob of adoring fans, darling. They love you so much that they, they each want a piece of you. Even so, I can't bring myself to, to hurt them. So why'd Snorpy have to go and weaponize Sprout? Ramble! I didn't know you were so punk rock. I'm not a punk or a rock. I, I can't do this. Well, I know who can. Darling, I've got them all warmed up. It's time for you to bring the house down. For just this moment, I will burn bright again. This is my swan song. I will devote my final ballet to Buck Snacks. Wiggle! <laughs> Why? Why'd you have to go? It's no use, Wambi. Must have learned a few things since the Stone Age. Well, what do you want me to do? I won't let them take my garden. There's hardly any garden left. There's enough. I still got my special sauce, fresh grown. Oh, good thinking. What? That's not what I meant. Oh, I didn't see you there. Would you mind helping out? Just a matter of life and death is all. Ouch! I'm such a failure. I couldn't even control my hunger. No wonder nobody believed in me. Wambus! You... you big dumb fool! <laughs> Is this really everybody? Oh, never mind! We gotta get on board now! Come on! We're not gonna make it! Thanks, Liz. Egg.
Wambi, why did you stay? I was always ready for my end, but not yours. I know you just wanted a place to call your own. I'll grow a garden with all your favorite plants. I'll make sure it lasts longer than us, at least. Wiggle, why'd you have to go and leave me? I finally had somebody who cared about, but... But it, I promise you, I'll carry your love with me. And I won't go giving it away to things that don't deserve it. Okay, I know when I'm beat. I draw the line at island full of monsters. All I wanted to do was quit my dead-end job and do what makes me happy. I don't need some big bug snack scam to do that. Hey, maybe I'll get started in the music business. While I regret that all my research was destroyed, I have come away with a revelation. I cannot improve Grumpus Kind if I refuse to understand it. It may be a long and frankly annoying endeavor, but it is one worth pursuing. I've never felt so wrong being right. I wish I hadn't wasted so much time telling riddles. I don't need to be all powerful to give good advice. I just need to be me, and those who listen will listen. Look at that mess. It seems my enemies aren't so all-powerful after all, but still, there were many close calls, and Chandler was always there for me. I think perhaps I could share everything with him. Bro, that was intense! There's no way I ever would have made it out of there by myself! Good thing Snorpy had my back. When did he get so strong? Maybe I hit my personal limit. But that doesn't matter. There's no limit to what we can do together! Hey buddy, are you ready to go? Alright everybody, we should head out! I hate leaving it like this. Liz and Egg, what if they're still out there? I don't know if I can move on. Not when we lost so many friends. I just wish there was a way we could go back and... and make things right. Don't you? Uh, yeah, you're right. I guess there's no use thinking that way. I can't undo what happened, but I can learn and try to put some good back in the world. It has to be enough, right? It's gonna take a while for the bug snacks to wear off on us. I can't go back home like this, so is it alright if I stay with you for a while? I can help you with your story. Maybe figure out which parts to tell, or... Great. Let's go. I have to admit, you got guts. Tracking down Elizabeth inside an erupting volcano? It's compelling, dramatic, sensational. I'd call it fiction if you didn't have this Philippus Yahoo along as a witness. <laughs> it's Philbo, actually. Point is, you're a regular Grumpter S. Thompson. It's just too bad those bug snacks weren't real, huh? <laughs> yeah, too bad. <laughs> I, I, I hate to think that we went through all that for nothing, so, um, I hope you can spread the truth about Snacktooth before anybody else gets hurt. Don't worry. GNN specializes in painful truths. And speaking of, you're fired. This story's a page-turner and all, but you lost your job the second you walked out that door. Oh, please. It's not like I expected you to come back. 
Also, you're legally dead. Might want to clear that up soon. Well, that wasn't ideal, but so... I hear the elections are coming up, and, uh, I could use a helping paw. 